Body Works video uh, for the exercise tube. This video is aimed at using, giving you a wide variety of exercises uh, using the exercise tube. Now these exercises are aimed at improving your strength, increasing muscle tone, and general fitness. All right, let's get started. Now to increase tension on the on the tube and provide some resistance, we're going to place one foot over the cable. All right, we're just going to keep it nice and light to start off with, and we're going to work on our biceps, pulling it up and down, up and down up and down and what you got to keep in mind here guys is just keeping the elbow in front of the in front of your body and strong in the shoulders up and down up and down that's all we're going to do keep it nice and simple nice and strong what you don't want to do is start to move the shoulder up and down a big mistake a lot of people make is it's just they just end up moving the shoulders and not actually working their biceps arms in front bending the elbows up straighten them down bending them up putting the tube under both feet, increasing the resistance of the tube, and again, same through, strong the upper body, strong your shoulders, and bring the elbows up, and then straighten them down, up and down, up and down, making sure you keep your shoulders nice and strong, keeping them back, elbow in front of the body, and straighten the arm, get a good strong grip, bringing up, bringing down, this exercise is great for increasing your overall strength in your arms, forearms and your grip, so up and down. Okay, we've done the bicep, which is the front of the arm, now we're going to focus on the back of the arm, which is the tricep, which is used for pushing, pushing yourself up, pushing things, opening doors, okay. Again, we're going to start off with a lot of resistance, putting one foot over the tube, this time we're going to stand over, stand in front, we're going to bring one arm behind and then straighten the arm up, okay. This pushing up motion, extending our elbow motion, is working our triceps, okay? So we can go straight up and down, up and down. This can also be done with two arms at the same time. Okay, so we're gonna bring the elbows down, bring it and straighten the arms. Bring it down, straighten them up, bring them down, straightening up. Okay, you can also change the actual grip of your hands, so from a new open grip, open palm, into a neutral grip. Again, the movement's still the same, and we're still focusing on the triceps, okay? Remember, three sets, 15 to 20 reps. You can do one repetition, one set of biceps, followed by one repetition or one set of triceps. That's one set of each, okay? And you can do it alternate that way, or you can do three biceps, three triceps, whichever way works best for you, or mix it up. All right, we've done our arms, we've worked our biceps, and we've worked our triceps. What we're going to do now, now we have bodies warm, we're going to start focusing on our on our shoulder and run through a range of shoulder exercises. Again, starting with a lot of resistance, all we're going to do first is just going to raise one arm up, raising it down. One arm up, raising it down, okay? Isolating the shoulder movement, just raising the arm and lowering. Up and down. Just to above shoulder height and then bringing it down. Just put both feet over the tube, putting further tension, and we're going to raise both arms up. Okay, same exercise, we're just bringing in greater intensity by doing two arms at the same time. So going up and down, up and down. Just keep in mind, there's resistance going up, slowly release it going down. Don't just let the cable pull you down. Exercise up and the movement pattern down. Work in our shoulders. Adding on to going forwards, we can go out to the side. Okay, so let's just start with one We'll start with low resistance, just putting one foot over the tube. And we're just going to raise arms out, raising it down. Arms up and down. Out to the side and down. Again, pulling it up and slowly carrying it down. Pulling it up, slowly carrying it down. Let's increase the resistance and just put two feet shoulder width apart, raising it up and slowly bringing the arms down. Raising it up, down. Okay, 15 to 20 reps. You should start to feel the the burn on your shoulders, okay? Up and down, up and down. If that gets too easy, you want to spice things up a little bit, make it a little bit interesting. Let's go one to the side, one in front. One to the side, one in front, okay? One to the side, and then one to the front at the same time. Or even furthermore, alternate them at each repetition, okay? And get you thinking. 
up and increase the intensity, which you'll get. Start to make you work harder, you start to breathe heavier. All right, another shoulder exercise. Starting with just a lighter resistance, only one foot on the tube. All we're going to do now is we're just going to bring the shoulders up and bring it down. So we're pulling up, okay, and pulling down. Pulling up with our shoulder and elbow, and then carrying the tube down. Up and down, up and down, okay? Or two arms together. Increase the efficiency, use both arms. Yeah? So pulling up and down, up and down. What you don't want to do, guys, is just pulling it up from your hand or just from your wrist. You want to get a nice good grip and then just shoulder and elbow up. Not too close together, okay? And not too high. Just nice and wide, about chest height, and then bring it down. Up and down. So we'll stand in front. We're going to bring the elbows up, up at shoulder height, okay? And we're just going to push it up. Down and up. Down and up. Okay, so again, we're working our shoulders, but we're bringing our elbows into it and we're going to straighten up. Again, you're going to be working your triceps here, up and down. So pushing it up, carrying it down. Pushing it up, carrying it down. Too easy for you? Let's go for two legs and bring it up. Push and down. Push and down. Push. Okay, we should be getting pretty warmed up. What I've done now is I've brought in our foam roller to incorporate into our, in our, into our routine with the exercise tubes. So what we're going to do is put that down. We're going to start working on our chest now. So the foam roller is going to be our bench. What we're going to do is going to put the tie one loop around the roller, okay, have an even lengths on either side, we're going to lie down. We're going to sit on one end of the foam roller, long ways, okay, just put your feet uh, wide enough to give you a bit, of, uh, a bit of balance, lie long ways, your head should be comfortably on, on the edge, don't have your head off the back of the roller, keep yourself nice and comfortable. Grab one handle, grab the other one, okay, what we're going to do now, is we're going to push up. We're going to push the handles up and guide the resistance of the tubes down. Up and down. This is working our chest. Okay, so we're going to push up and squeeze our pecs together. Stretch them on the way down. Squeeze them on the way up. Stretch and down. So stretching on the way down and then pushing on the way up. Okay. Also, you can also do single arm. One at a time. Keeping your other side still pushing single arm movements. You can alternate them up and down. Okay, so while the one arm's going up, you gotta keep this side balanced. Okay, so you're not just working the single arm, you're working the other side as well. And then move into two arms. You can alternate them one at a time, and then go straight into two. Okay, 15 to 20 reps, three reps. Give your chest a good workout. So I hope you enjoyed that guys, and look forward to seeing you soon.